Hello, my name is Gail Palmer, and I'd like to spend a few moments with you describing an article that I wrote with Douglas Tilley entitled, Using Enactments to Shape Moments of Contact and Change Interaction in Emotionally Focused Therapy. A primary intervention that's used in EFT to shift a couple from relationship distress to attachment security is the use of the enactment. In an enactment, the therapist directs the couple member or the family member to turn and look at their loved one's face and share a significant emotional experience. In the article, we compare and contrast the use of the enactment in EFT with similar interventions used in other models in the field of couple and family therapy. We also describe the theory that underlies our understanding and use of enactments and begin to describe the process of the enactment in the therapy room. From an attachment perspective, the EFT enactment begins to interrupt and make explicit those negative interactional cycles that are creating the attachment insecurity. We then help the couple or family have a new conversation together through the enactment that actually provides moments of contact that begins to build and broaden the positive cycles of, of interaction that then lead to the couple feeling more secure and the family being a secure base. In this article, we describe four basic types of enactments and we also give transcript examples. From these examples, we then provide the reader with a generic model that can be used to help structure successfully enactments in the therapy room. In this model, the reader learns how to set the stage for the enactment, to give the direction, to process the experience, and then summarize and give uh, meaning to the new conversation. Finally, we um, end the article with an extended example of an actual enactment from a therapy case. It is our sincere hope that this article generates interest and curiosity in the use of this uh, intervention, that we help contribute to the literature, and finally, that we may create some interest in doing further research that either looks at the process of the enactment or looks at the enactment as it relates to treatment outcome. Thanks for your time.